Y'all, this is so motherfucking good. All right, everybody done seen Mary Me Chicken, right? So I decided to make me some wife me up salmon. Same concept, different protein. Let's get into it. You wanna start off with some fresh salmon and some jumbo shrimp. You're gonna season that real good on both sides. So my seasonings of choice was black and Cajun seasoning, lemon pepper, dried parsley, crushed red pepper flakes, Montreal chicken seasoning, salt and pepper, and fresh lemon juice. The lemon juice helped out a lot because it made it more of a wet marinade and I was able to rub it in a little bit. Now you can use whatever the fuck you prefer, but it's just what I use. Now it's very important to season your salmon on both sides because you want your shit to be a bad bitch from all sides or a bad fish, whatever you want to say. Now y'all already know I'm using that bougie butter, that Willy Wonka stick. So I went ahead and let that melt down and I added some fresh garlic. Once your butter get to popping like that op, it's never going to see you in person for real. You want to put your salmon inside and let it sear on one side and cover it up. Once it cooks for about 2-3 minutes, you're going to uncover it and you're going to flip them. I decided to add some more smoked paprika for some color and then I used my brush and I just brushed it with the butter inside the pan for more flavor. And it also keeps it from drying out. Once that was done, I transferred it into my baking sheet. Now in that same pan, you're going to add your shrimp and let it cook on one side until it starts turning slightly pink. I also added some more smoked paprika to this to add some coloring and then I let these cook. You want to flip them over about a minute in. You don't want to overcook your shrimp because we're going to throw this whole dish back in the oven. Now in that same pan with all those good old flavors, you're going to add some heavy whipping cream, some salt and pepper, and some sun-dried tomatoes. And you're just going to deglaze that pan and get all them good flavors marinating together. Once my sauce started bubbling, I went ahead and added my Parmesan and mozzarella cheese. I mixed that up real good and then I added my sauce on top of my salmon and shrimp and then I topped that with some fresh basil and some sun-dried tomatoes. Now we're going to put this in the oven at 350 and we're going to cook it for about 15 to 20 more minutes. While that was going, I went ahead and made my spaghetti noodles and then I drained those and put them back onto the stove. I added some more of that Willy Wonka butter to my noodles so they wouldn't all stick together and I just mixed that in until it melted. Boom, we done. Yeah. 